All right. Good afternoon. Welcome to the end of day record uh, recording for today, and uh, end of day reviewing. And today is uh, May twenty second, two thousand twenty four, and it's Wednesday. And a mid week right here. We have a lot of action today, especially. Uh, especially um, the FOMC meetings today. Uh, we look for the setup, but you know what? We mix this because we haven't seen that setup before. We might, we might, but uh, we skip the setup. And also after the markets, the huge volatilities um, because of the Nvidia. Nvidia uh, earning is huge. Nvidia earning is huge. Is its, um, it's, it's revenue sales jumped to the sixty-eight percent something, and uh, it's now the stock splits ten to one. Wow, that's huge right there. And that's which why we see that the volatiles today and. Uh, by the way, we are in week 22 of the year 2024, and one year we have 52 week and four quarter. So each quarter have 13 week. So week 22, so we have um, four more week. We will finish quarter two right there. So June is very critical. Um, it can be a second half of the year to see how the market set. Uh, sets the tone, set the direction for the rest of the year. So, so far, uh, the first quarter is very strong for, for this year. Uh, if we look at the charts in terms of quarter, uh, uh, let's see, where is our quarter? Oh, I got monthly. No. Monthly. Hold on. Where we are see. Okay, so right here we have month, right? We have April is sell and then May is uh go uh reverse. So what pattern we have? Break, reverse. Break reverse, reverse, and break again. Break, break. So it could be a second like that. Um, it could be a retracement, but let's see. Uh, let's look at a quarter. We can see quarter profile. Yeah, it can be um, next quarter. Can be very interesting because we see the short setup right here. You see that it break the level and then. Um, it retests from above, so that's the signature of a a fall breakout uh, at the top right there. You want to break it, and you want it to test from above. Then the next candle gonna be uh, we're gonna anticipate the next candle gonna be uh, you know something like this. Not exactly, but gonna break that level. It may go all the way to uh, to the high. You know. So that's what we anticipate for next quarter right there. That's the beautiful one just uh, for, for short right there. So you have break, retest from above, uh, and then uh, break it. Let's look at the, the setup we have. All right, we have a setup right here. It's not exactly, but the concept is the same. You have break right there, and um, you want to retest from above, and then next it's going to reverse right there. So break. Retest from above and then it's gonna reverse. Similar right here. You have break and retest from below. In this case, a long setup. If you flip this, it's gonna be a short setup right there. So break it and then you retest from below right here. If you retest twice, then the, the expansion move or the reversal move is gonna be very explosive right there. So, something right here. Right. Um, 
we may see that uh, it will one two three uh, you know break one and then retest from above two and then reverse or we can see this scenario can play out also which is another uh, second um, the third quarter is going to be something like this and it did also test it level so we have two scenarios right there right so we're perfect you have retest you have retest uh, above twice so that means the expansion move the reverse move gonna be very you know explosive right there then it could be uh, uh, the huge move maybe go all the way down to the level right here you see that right there it can go all the way to that level yes that's another uh, scenario if we look at the height right now look at the high time frame quarter right there so that's this could be um, the whole year right there um, yes so it may be all the way here or go back to the open so this year will be <laughs> will be a uh, a break even year for luck for the better world right there yeah that's 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 our you know entertainment that idea right there so that's quarter um quarter two and quarter three right there so we're looking for next not next week but uh three weeks from now uh this week gonna be huge because um let's back up a little bit uh next week we're gonna see the gdp data released in may 30 which it can present as a good move for us to catch you know good move for us to to write on right there and then um after that uh you know we can typically see um yeah after that we're gonna see the non-farm payroll on friday the 7th of june uh, where else non-farm payroll oh non-farm payroll right here so gonna be june 7 june 7 right here yeah the first friday of of, of the month that way you see non-farm payroll is a very good uh good trade because gonna set up the tone or the direction for the whole month the may you see that um friday after friday uh non-farm payroll uh, the whole month is 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 explosive up for, for may right there uh, the same for A april after may uh for fifth it moved down yeah you can see that all right so um that's what we're looking for we look for the um the gdp data and then um uh, we look for non-farm payroll but you see we non-farm payroll yes yeah, no problem. Uh, this one should be um, should be G, uh, not GDP. It should be it should be CBI. So CBI at uh, June 12th, right there, and then uh, we have a Fed also on the 11th. 12th. So it's going to be a big week for us. Uh, next couple of week, we have a huge uh, opportunity ahead of us like every day every week all right now go into the charts to see you know all right look at the recording right at first when it start we make the trade right here and it's very hard to read at the beginning especially when the market is open you have uh you know um because you know you have a feeling like uh, you know excitement it started 
it's very hard it's very hard to read very hard to come outside out but now we can see you see the setup right here you see the level of that uh, high time frame four hour time frame 53 37 25 right there so you see that it break that level it tests from below break it back test from above break it test from below and then it break it right there and then it's test and then we break it right away so right here we should put by stop right here uh yeah by stop right here uh at at um 9 15 right there because there's no reason for it to come back here because it already, it already completely break that level there's no reason for it to test it. the only reason for it to test is it to break it and it did break at 9 uh 9 15 and when it go to 9 30 we, we're a little bit confused but if we see that at 9 30 we can still go along at this level at 53 38 right there because you see that it tests below the one below one two three four then the fifth time if you're gonna go back here you're gonna break it it's not gonna you're not gonna uh, back down it's you're gonna break it so we we we, we make that setup right there yeah let, let's go to the charts to see to see what is um we talking about right here right here at the beginning you see that yeah so we put 38 right there you see it test below actually after break test below one two three four that's no reason for its comeback and we can go in and go along and target this level where it is what where it it tests from below it gonna you know revisit level it did it revisit level right there so that is our uh, mixing the tray right there for, for this tray yeah let, let's do a quick document on this tray and we just simply target right here we have one R right there very easy one R easy straight easy money right there yeah see that it retests from below four times and just like that because did you see the 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 reversal very explosive because it retests from below more than one time more than one time we mix this setup we, we mix read them because we can't like um <coughs> We mentioned before opening is, is very hard to trade especially for novice like us we need to can learn to manage our emotion otherwise it's very hard to trade so basically um let's write out this setup and make sure that is it become our second nature when we see this setup uh when it forming or even before it forming that will help a, a lot with the execution right there for breakout at 53, 38, 25. I mean, at this level, we can also see um, the 36 also a good good level right there if we want to entry early. Look at the same idea. It break it, text below twice. Break it back, test above. And this is the last break. This candle, we saw this setup before. This is the last one that uh, before is 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 uh, is uh, reverse, and this candle make sure it close for it level. If not close it level, then don't go in. And this is a closing, but anyway, go with it level first, and we can come back with this level. Uh, for breakout uh, at this level, we do have you know one two three step right there. Break and retest from below in this case we have what four time is that four time one uh, one two three four four time that's quite quite a retest right there so the more it retests uh, 
the more explosive the reverse uh, the reverse is gonna be that's from our observation right there and then we have re reverse that's the four background for pre breakout you want to break reverse back right away that's is the real breakout happen yeah so we have break right here at this level make sure that we uh, We document right. Make sure we document right. Yeah, so it's a full breakout. You know, when it happened in real time, uh, we couldn't see that, but but now we we see it. So let's document this. So basically, you have a um, at this level. At 38 right here 38 right here that's the level so basically um, we have break in this case we have a break and then we have uh, hold on I think we have break right here right this we we we're talking about this level right there. Uh hold on. I think we touch below uh how many times? It's one, two, three, four times. So this level thirty eight twenty five. Thirty eight twenty five. Yes, that level thirty eight twenty five. Not this level. We can go in and lit level also. But let go at this level is it's clear. It must clear that it break. Uh, oh yeah, it's, it break here also, right? right? No, it break right here. Break twice, break here and break here, and we test one, two, three. After it break, so it's it's break twice actually. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah, it break twice. If you see that it break twice, but let keep it simple. Uh, let it keep it simple so we let confusion. Let confusion. That is the break way right there. All right, is the break, and then you have retest, and then you have a retest right here. You have four time retest right there. One, right. You have retest right there. You have retest right there, retest right there, retest right there, and then now you have a reverse. So basically, this is the the number one, right? Number one is break, and then. We have the retest up here. Retest from below. And this time we have yeah four time which is very very special right there. And then uh, we have number three right here. So basically three step one to take and then it's gonna be reverse. Basically, you put a buy stop here. We never get lost because there's no reason to come back. The only reason to come back is to break it. So that's an idea right there. And um, we check M right there. So the risk reward ratio is uh, one R right there. Yep. Let's say this one is a. For breakout reversal, right? We can call this a for breakout reversal. Let's save it. Yep. 
is a four breakout reversal. Is that right? Or it's going to be a, uh, a retracement end? Yeah, it is. It depends, right? Uh, but let's go with that for now. Uh, four, three, three, eight, twenty-five, right there. Let's save it. Save this. All right, we save it. Let's close this. Yeah, so basically, uh, let's look at the recording again. So yeah, right there, with a buy stop right there at 38.25 right there. Yeah, we, we didn't see it in the real time. We got confused right here, we got too much, too much right here. But if we are quick enough and, and uh, experience enough we can see that we co can go in at this level also the 37 also a good setup it break test from below break it back and then break it again then it's gonna reverse yep that's the first trade we mix yeah you see that it's explosive right there oh wow then wow look at that it's one if we miss this one how do we yeah i think i think we did check this tray because you see that it hang above this level yeah would it go short let's see let's see what what it, what, what did we do right here all right we check we take the first tray. Let's see. Yeah, let's see the recording. Okay, here's the first tray we tried to check. Right? As soon as we saw it, we thinking about a setup. Okay, break and hang above that level. So we put a sell stop right here. Yeah, that's the screenshot we check. Now look at the recording we have. It's right here. Brilliant idea. <laughs> Cannot believe it. Okay, so yeah, we would have sell top right there. But you know what happened? We so convenient. I mean we so confident, right? As soon as we saw this candle, we thought, wow, beautiful. Short them. Sell into the sell into the the what? Yeah, sell into the up close candle. We haven't done that before. So we said, oh, let's try it out, sell into the up close cancel, see how that feel. <laughs> we did that. You see, we're going to say, yeah, we're selling. But uh, we mistake that with hot, we didn't check at all. We should set only one contract. But accidentally, this is the, the setup the five contract. For some reason, it remember the setup we uh, the last trade we take the day before is five contracts, so it took five contracts and we surprised. We said, wow, we thought uh, we just you know do one contract, but uh, when we do the stop limits, you know, stop sell is a one contract, but when we hit right here, it's jump to five contract. But we learn now a lesson next time if we saw and make an error, we just to need to close trade. Uh, right away uh, but anyway uh, you see that <laughs> we sell anyway we're so confident with this you know setup so we sell into that before the market can hit our you know our order right there so let's see so we're thinking wow we got it we got it this time beautiful setup but here here that's that's the story we believe right there wow 
we should check our profit grade. <laughs> because actually, in order to be this more reliable, you want this one to tap this level. But anyway, we learn our lesson. Well, we saw us go against us. Then it go back to break even. Um, then it come back. You see that? It come back a few. Uh, a few what? A few the order we put right there. It's very surprise, su su surprising to us right there. So it's uh, ten oh seven. Let's see what it ten oh seven. Ten oh seven. Let's remove this one. So 1007 is right here. 1007 right here. Yeah, this candle, you see that? So we try to sell right here. It's the right idea if we do the at this uh you know 150. But right here it consolidate so it, it stopped but out right there. So but anyway let's finish uh the, the few the video first right there. And you know what? It not we feel that something not right because you want it to be a response very quick normally the four break out this response very quick very quick because they already set up the liquidity so they want to execute a big order that reason why it's going to be a very huge move so we thinking we thinking should we stay or we go exit the trade and eventually you see that we uh, we um, we close the position I think we close this took a loss uh, even yeah wow we took a huge loss right there. you know what we add more look at that we add to that's crazy now we see that we do it crazy like that we accidentally right and oh we see it see when we add into our side when when did we do that okay still five right and then it hit oh it hit this guy five contract that's right so we accidentally put um uh when we sell into here we actually hit five contract and this one is not accident that's that is a very risky move we should not you know with this setup but anyway you know we have to accept this you're not gonna have a perfect uh setup to pull a trigger this time it did, did not play out but next time it could play out so oh uh, no worry right there so it does look right uh, it flip us so we feel wow it doesn't look right at all so we close we hit close position and we get our we loss we shall break we really just took a loss <laughs> yeah we just um, close so that's our first rate right there we took a loss about 770 something uh, right there that is for last for the first trade. And now let's look at the second trade. Okay, here's our second trade. We uh, hmm. Uh, we sell stuff at forty two. Right here, we sell stuff at level at ten fifty. Hmm. Ten fifteen, we sell stuff right here oh 10 15 right here okay uh, but it pull back hmm that's amazing yeah you right you see that we put right there so let's see how in the recording uh it looked like all right <laughs> so here's our second try right we do 10 side tens also we're very eager to get our money back the rest of the way. We should not do that, <laughs> but it's okay. And the executor idea is right. You see that? It hang above this level. So it's perfect to go in and, and sell at that level. And let's see. Yes, so we get into the trade. 
not bad at all and it moves into our direction wow uh, yeah six minutes it moves to our direction right there it, it, it get out, out of view and you see right there right there so it moves to our direction we thought that it's gonna hit the level but look 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 it pull back it's so scary uh, that's the beauty of trading right there you have six to volatility no and then it get back and forth now 50 minutes right you have to go through that candle so 50 minutes already passed so now it's the next candle it's like wow perfect that's above twice at the level that is our setup right you're gonna break the test above twice and then boom we thought that wow we're gonna get this time we do let's see if we get this time yes beautiful right there see that there right we have you know 1000 right there we thought i are gonna go get but you never know wow we we move our target profit <laughs> We see the big candle down close. Wow, let's move the target. But you know what? It reverse back. And we say no, we're not gonna give back the the profit. We close. Close. We close the position right there. You see it? We close. And uh, we get back the you know I want to break even right there. Eight hundred right there. So, yes, so the balance is, you know, lost $56, so for two trade, right? First trade we lost, and this trade, uh, we get it back, second trade. All right, let's look at the third trade we take. So basically, that's for, uh, the first trade, uh, we follow our system. The same thing with the second trade. Even though the first trade follows up, we lost, it's okay. As long, as long as we follow our setup, the same for the second trade. Okay, so the, set, the third trade we come in at 11.15. Right. We actually need to put right here, the buy stop right here, but we come in a little bit late. Come in a little bit late at 53.43. Yeah, let's see, 53.43. Why is that set up? 53, 43, uh, 15. Yeah, we see right here. You see, see? Right, right here. Right there. Is that the 15? Yeah, that's our number 3, right? 15 right there. And to this, no. 11, 15. 11, 15. Oh, okay. 11 minutes is not there yet. 11, 15 is here. Eleven fifteen. No. Right here. That where we go in. 11, 6 right there. You see that? That is 11, 15. Mm, okay, let's watch the recording for the trade so we can have a better idea. So trade is trade number three. Let's watch. Alright, here's our trade number three. It goes all the way very beautiful, but we only do two contracts. First, we do one contract. We sell at that level on 11. Uh, uh, you know at the uh, eleven fifteen we go in eleven fifteen right there and you see it's beautiful see that yeah see huge candle hit the level look boom right there that's giant right there so let's see what happened at eleven fifteen hold on so, oh, 11, uh, yeah, 11, 5 right there. Yeah, right here, you see that? 
15 right there yes okay we make the one of the recording we mix about one 30 minutes right here because we have some uh you know power out it in our our neighbor so we, we we lost that i can see that now yeah so basically right there we see the setup right we put a cell stop right here it's a perfect cell stop right here however we go coming late but to hit our target it's a huge move right there all right so we follow our setup cool with the tray number three all right now do see what tray number four and five right here yeah tray four and tray five a little bit um clumsy So basically, we sell at the level. We see this candle test above, right? Break test above, so we sell at 53.40. Um, 53.40 right there. That's 53.40, but may, we may entry early because the note right here said that we are early entry to have wait for 45 so let's see how it's play out in the the trade let's look what's the recording all right let's look at the recording i think we run uh, we learn a great lesson on trade number four number five okay so we see that perfect setup right it's the perfect we check see the break and then the test from above then this one gonna be what it, this one gonna touch the level it's gonna break it that's the logic and perfect and yeah it's, it get feel right there you see that it's supposed to be go down right but somehow is it did not it go back and then we think to ourselves wow maybe we flip too long <laughs> You see that? Actually, yeah, she flipped too long. And then you see that we reversed the position right there from uh, from short to long right there. See so right that? We still uh, short. and then we reverse yes you see that we, we just hit reverse our position we get, we, we get our short uh, we want to go long we want to go long but we, we learned a great, great deal right there but actually the market really forward right here as soon as we go long you see that right as soon as we go long Look what happened. <laughs> you see, as soon as we go along, boom, we go back. You see that? We're thinking, wow. You see that? As we go along, uh, it reverse back on us. That's two trade right there. We go short, right? We go short the level and say, wow, there's no reason for it to come back. <laughs> And we sweep too long, we got stop out. But we'd run the great deal right here. Let's look at the charts right here. We see how the market really fool us right here. The, right, the idea is right. The setup is still valid right here. And when you see breaking and it test from above one, test from above twice, then uh, you put a uh, a sell order right here and it can you trade but how about it retest one more time it's just it's it's just uh the way uh the algo run right there if we stop all the people who move moving they stop loss too soon then boom the last move is really the huge move right there yep so it depends on the end it depends on the time if this level is right for a short right there but if we entry too soon around here we we get stop out easily 
Remember, we did go in right here. Our go over here, right here, and it, it reversed back to us. We thought, oh, we're going to go long, but as soon as we go long, we're going to stop our right away. But look at this pattern and learn. And we did take a um, great lesson right here for this setup. Yeah. Let, let, look at the lesson we learned right here. All right, here's the lesson we learned for the tray number four and tray number five right there. So basically, we can feel right here. We have a good idea. We identify the setup early, right? We see the the break, right? Break right here and reverse. But we we forgot this this step, right? This reverse back right away is a signal that it's gonna be a second leg down. Whenever we want to see that the second step is reverse back right away, then it likely a a second leg down, a real breakdown. You don't want to be reverse back away. You want it to be test from below, then that's gonna be a full breakout. But in this case it's gonna be a real breakout, second leg down. So um you see that right there. So it's break it this level, let's pick this level. This is what you can apply for any level for this three level, but that give the very easy one that easy to see, which is the fifty three forty right here. So it break down this level, it reverse back right away. It no no test from below. And then it tests from above. And we saw that we go try to go in right here and you remember we got stop out and then we six weeks too long. <laughs> We got stop out with this candle. So the, with the novice trader, it's easy to get confusion. But after a while, the con, well, after we practice a, a, for a while, we see the pattern. I think the, uh, we can see the clarity right there. The confusion turn into clarity uh, for today. I mean, after today, when we, we will never get you know uh, into this trap again. It really confuses us uh, um, today. But after today, uh, and, and we figured out this. Uh, I, I I don't think we we uh, we're gonna get trapped in this. We will see clear picture right there. So basically, um, we whenever I see the reverse back right away, looking for a second leg down or second leg up, depend on scenario. But in this case, we focus on second leg down right there. So it's reverse back right away, All right? And then it says it tests from above twice, uh, and, and, and this guy should be a a break, right, which is all the way down. But for somehow, it did not uh, follow through. It reversed back right away. That's the step number five. And this reverse back right away right here, it's going to be a auto block, bearish auto block right there, and it's going to be explosive move down. Uh, exactly right there. Yep, yep. So normally it can finish at right here. A step, you know, uh, uh, step number four, it finish, boom, it break. After two tests above, you're gonna break it. But in this case, it reverse back. So where it give us opportunity. I mean, if, if we know that there's opportunity to go short right there. But if for a novice a trader like us, we don't recognize it until today. So it's, it's a explosive move already you know set in place right there and all smart money gonna put the short order in here to match this and look really boom so we really are grateful for the train number four number five we took and we hit run hit lesson right there all right now go to uh train number uh train number six yeah, let's look at the trade number six to see uh, what we have. All right, here's our trade number six. Basically, we say, wow, it break the level 53, 40. Why coming back? The only is coming back is just to uh, to break that level. So we, we enter the trade. Let's look at the, the, the video, the recording. Yes, so we go in with that um, a little bit late. So it's there yeah, 40, is that 43? No, is that we go in at 41? We should go in at 40, but we go a little bit late, so it's, we're going at 41. That's okay. 
but when the train right here, as soon as we go in, you know what happened? We thought, wow, weird. Because whenever it break level and it reverse back right away, it tells you that the second leg down is, is in the place. That's the reason why as soon as we realize that, we get out of the train. So that is our subconscious mind tell it right there. Because that's the beauty right there. When we practice enough, we know that something is not right, we get out. And, and that exactly there there. <laughs> we go along with that, but this is the set of to show them. Yeah, I think it's uh, 13, 15 right there, which is... right here. That is... <laughs> Yeah, we, uh, we're so glad that we closed that candle. But if we smart enough, like we learned for today, not smart, but it's, uh, yeah. <laughs> or we uh, experience enough, for lack of a much better word uh, to say, experience enough. Because some, some people say tra trading is not require in intelligence at all. It's about consistent and, 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 and discipline. And, and we totally agree, you know, not smart is and uh, should not play uh, a cr critical critical role in you know self trading and you see that we get out we feel something wrong because when it break the level and it reverse back right away it tells you that uh, the uh, the second leg down gonna come down which is the real break out you don't want to see it reverse back right away if you want it to be a fall break out it had to be tested from below like it's right here, you see it here? That is the fall breakout at that level. You see that? It break, test, test from below, and then it can break it back. You see that? Uh, what you don't see it here. You can see it break, and then it reverse back away. That is the second leg down, which is we already, you know, discuss uh, quite extensive right here. You don't want it to be reversed back right away right here. And the same right here, you don't want it to be reversed back really. Beautiful. So we said, you know, six tray for today. And um, let's see what tomorrow we're going to bring to us. But uh, I think it's last this. That's it for today. Thank you for your time and uh, interest. We always uh, appreciate these opportunities. And uh, we do what we love and success is coming our way. Bye for now and have a great evening. Good luck and good trading and see you tomorrow.